shifts that same weekend Me? on December 5th. Every but time. We get to see it here. So it's Liquid Nairo once again. Wow, Nairo is Pits? No, Dark Pits is that? Is that Pit or Dark, dark Pit? Interesting. I haven't seen him go this in a little bit. I mean, if Tabuz is going to whip out the Villager and Nairo is confident enough, he might as well just get a little secondary practice going on. I feel like this is good practice for a possibly fighting Renai. I know it's just one crew battle, one, you know, three stock match, but, you know, Renai kind of went in on the Rosalina in that one match. So, just in case, you might want to practice a couple other matchups for fighting. Uh, Zero Suit? Um, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You might want to uh, practice a couple of other matches for fighting. Um, Villager? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Murabito. Murabito. I think too much Japanese Smash. I'm forgetting the English name. <laughs> wow, really? <Yeah>. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Kitaro confirmed biggest weeaboo in the world. I mean, its name is Kitaro. Don't let us say. You don't let say. Ooh, nice oh. spike. What? 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 He hit A, I think. That's what it looked like. It looked like he hit A. That is <laughs> he just ran out of, uh, ran out of gas? Wow. Yeah, yeah, to run out of gas. Wow, I'm shocked. I thought he grabbed the wedgie, and so I thought he had the up uh, come back. Yeah, I've never seen it actually happen. Poor villager runs out of gas. <laughs> okay. Wow, the buzz is still doing pretty well. Yeah, this is definitely fairly close. I wish oh. Nairo just used pin. No! Up, uh, what? He almost... Not that he's... <laughs> That's what? Not that he was going to save him, but, you know, Nairo was already going to die. I wish Nairo uh, used Pit, though, man, because those arrows are just terrible. Or uh, Dark Pit? Dark Pit arrows, yeah. He was, like, trying to snipe the buzz from off the stage, and the arrow just, like, had no curve to it, so it didn't hit him. It could be one of those things, like, uh, I play Dr. Mario, even though I know Mario might be better or better no, for no, a certain no, no, matchup. No, dude. Those are, like, totally different worlds. Pit yeah. and Dark Pit, it's literally like, hey, you want... Good arrows are really not good arrows. Or you want to be cool, you know, dark pit. Yeah, edgy pit. Or normal. <laughs> no, wait, let's hear that voice. Actually, I think it's the same voice actor. Anyways, let's keep going. <laughs> the same voice actor <laughs> with, like, a little a little filter or something. But there we Very go. Very nice end it. All those, like, triple... Wow. Okay, looking that fancy. edge cancel, side B? All right, cool. that was pretty sexy, yeah. So I can see what Nairo practices in training room or against his viewers, possibly, when he's, like, I can see him styling. Yeah, with his four glory characters. practice. <laughs> yeah, this is this is definitely against uh, four glory, the way he's uh, at least doing the flashiness. Yeah, one of the most mystifying things about Nairo in uh, Brawl was how instead of practicing with his already top player brother, this kid got good by playing computers. And now he, like, his main practice is stream viewers and four glory. You know what I'm saying? Nairo doesn't, like, have a car and drive down to, like, the loft or other hubbubs. Or uh, hubs, rather. Yeah, yeah. Hubbubs. Yeah. Every other top that player has been yeah. to the loft more than Nairo has. Yeah, exactly. Mr. R. Yeah. It's, uh, it's weird, and Nairo lives, like, 50 minutes away. Yeah, it's not like he goes on, like, practice quests, you know, and he's very dedicated to his stream. But he still manages to stay extremely sharp, like, number one or two in the world. Well, I mean... I guess consistency wise, we'll, we'll still give Zero the title. But current MLG champion, and this kid plays Four Glory all the time. Undefeated since then. Yeah, that's actually true. Yeah, what's his streak now? Um, he, he might be yeah. it's about Maybe to, some of the Nightboots. He's about to be plus one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shout out to the Nightboots. No, I don't know. Wow! Oh my god, that was sick. A reflected, pocketed gyro. That's four times strength, I believe. Or close to it. I like how he just keeps on him no matter what. Does not give Villager any space. Oh my goodness. Might need to give her a little bit more. <laughs> yeah, definitely gotta respect that character like right in her face. Because her jab is pretty good too. As far as those not gonna kill. Yeah, but it puts him in a good position. Wow, see if he was pit, he would just have to like aim the arrow around, like, you know, etch a sketch. But instead he <laughs> tried really hard to hit it. <laughs> he might like the slower arrows. It's not even that they're slow, it's just that you can't aim them, you know what I'm saying? I feel like that's actually like a huge objective disadvantage to playing Dark Pit instead of Pit. Wow, and uh, he's trying to edge guard really hard off stage. I know Village's um, recovery is a little linear, but I'm shot to see goes so far off, and he's probably going to do it again. He is Nairo. Yeah, oh, Nairo oh. loves going off stage. <laughs> Nairo's like top one most <laughs> yeah. likes to go off top stage one. guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like the old days. Yeah, dude. If he has a chance to end your stock, he's going to take it. You can have like a 100% lead. Always be scared. He's going to go off stage. Yep. Okay. Still is very, very close, but here comes the hard part for DeBuzz. Securing a kill. Uh-oh. Yo, yo, I will, like, quit smash 
burn my Wii U and everything. If Nairo hits him with, uh, oh man, I, oh, uh, reflecting the bowling ball. Reflecting the bowling ball when he does a close punch. If he reflects that and kills him like that. Oh, you're calling, you're calling some high level commentators curse. Oh wow, I'm surprised it did not KO. It is Jairo from far away, so it's not as strong as up close. And that back throw, back throw. Yeah, okay. No DI is going to save you from that at that percent. A little tiny bit of a lead here from Nairo, but the buzz, I mean, all he's got to do is throw a sufficient amount of stuff to cause 46 damage. You know, 48 damage. Yeah, and he's back in the lead. Yeah, bowling ball will work out really well. Or even a chop tree sometimes kills the video. Oh, yeah, dude, the chop tree is like. Absolutely insane. Like, without even hitting the tree, too. Just the axe. Very nice by DeBuzz, using the axe to push Nairo away and hide behind his tree. Also, after the shield stun buff, man. 14 damage on the axe. It's so much shield stun. Yeah. Up throw. I feel an up smash coming in. There it was. Oh. No lag. Can you get the up throw? I thought, I thought some nutty stuff was about <laughs> to go down. I was like, man, I've seen DeBuzz on the top left. Oh, <gasps> my goodness. Got baited, Ooh. but not a KO just yet. Yeah, I can't believe they didn't kill at 1-3. Oh, goodness. He went for the dare, too, and he goes for it again. And is he going to go for the Yo, bear? Yo, Nairo, what is wrong with you, dude? Chill. Do not play with this guy All right. off the stage. You must recover as soon as possible. I want to at least see the Rosa come out. You know, like, at least try it. Uh, ex especially against the Dark Pit, uh, it might be able yeah, to work. right? It's like, maybe Zero Suit Samus is a little scary, but, I mean, this this is something certainly doable for DeBuzz's version. Yeah. But he has not switch. I think he's just going to stick it out. He, he might, like, have already resigned to his fate, and he's like, all right, man, you know, I might as well just get as much tournament-level experience at the top level uh, with my villager. What's one tournament? Also, the C. What? <laughs> All right, so we're going to Duck Hunt. Um, pretty good for Villager, because she or he can just run away and throw them into projectiles and space really well. But Nairo's not going to let him run away. Like, Dark Pit's going to always be in his face. Just oh. waiting for it to land. <laughs> and then the dog was going to come up and ruin Nairo's fun, but he started, he started to see himself rising. <laughs> all right, all right, man, shit. Oh my oh, goodness gracious. Yo, I thought he was playing Dark Pit, not Captain Falcon. I'm telling you, no space. Wow. Okay, wow, wow. <laughs> I was like getting ready to talk about a move or something. Like, oh, that was very smart. No. He was not spacing. <laughs> that was, you know, subsequently very smart by not doing it. Yeah. <laughs> Nairo, if you reflect this man's bowling ball into his face. If he said it louder, he might just go for it. Nairo, if you reflect this man's bowling ball into his face, I will actually die. He looks too focused. Oh my oh! goodness, what is going on? Oh! oh my god! What? What? Alright, I'm done. I'm Max Ketchum. Follow me on Twitter at Juice Doom. This has been yeah, KTOL 14. Talk. I'm out of here. Bye. See you later. You guys can follow me at underscore and Cortez underscore. Yo. Yo, that was crazy, bro. Why you go that far off stage? What's the